While some parents are racing to get their children ages 12 to 15 vaccinated today, others still have a lot of questions. Experts from Michigan Medicine held a live stream this afternoon to help address some of those concerns. A big question for many parents, how do we know there won't be long-term side effects from the vaccine in children? Experts say rare but serious vaccine side effects generally occur within weeks at most, not years later. I can't fathom how this vaccine over any other vaccine would have these sort of long-term effects. I think what has happened is so much mistruth and miscommunication has gone out. A related question, what about claims the vaccine could affect future fertility? I honestly don't know where that came from or how that could even be associated with this vaccine. Anybody interested in vaccine history, um, the same sort of social <laughs> media myth went out about HPV vaccination many, many years ago. So what kind of typical side effects should we expect in children age 12 to 15? About 90% of kids are going to have side effects considered mild. So anywhere from sore arm where the shot was given to maybe a headache or a fever or a little bit of muscle aches. And generally those are um, fully gone in a day or two. Finally, are there any added concerns about the vaccine in children with allergies? There is absolutely no contraindication for them getting the vaccine. They do recommend, however, that they bring their EpiPen and some Benadryl with them to have on hand. And anybody that has a history of um, any sort of severe allergic reaction or anaphylaxis is asked to wait for 30 minutes post vaccine instead of just that 15 minute time frame. The complete question and answer session lasted almost 40 minutes. You can watch the full recording on our homepage at clickondetroit.com.